Can you tell us about a new construction and the benefit of a buyer's agent? Sure. So uh, I think, I guess people often see that there's also, oftentimes there's a, an on-site sales rep in the new construction homes and that maybe they have to go through that person. Um, but one thing I, I just want buyers to know is that that, that on-site salesperson does represent the builder slash seller. Um, and, and, and in most cases, the, the buyers, in all cases to, to my knowledge, is that uh, a buyer's agent is allowed and they are able to represent that buyer. So Kathy, I want to back up a little bit so that people have a clear understanding and appreciation of when you say it's at no cost to the buyer. What does that mean? Correct. In, in any situation um, when you're dealing in real estate, it's typically it's the seller who pays both realtors. So that's no different when you're dealing with contractors. So, uh, you know, people are driving around, you know, they, they, they see homes, they walk into the model home, and, and sometimes you think, well, maybe I'm going to get a better cost or a better deal if I just use their agent. And that's not the case. But, you know, to Johnny's point, you know, that listing agent is still working for the contractor. It's not to say that they're not going to try to do a good job for you. But often, um, you know, you see them the day that you write the contract, they're going to schedule appointments, but you might not see them again. You know, whereas you've got a buyer's <clears throat> agent there walking with you every step of the way, going through the process of something that you're pretty unfamiliar with. You know, when you go through, you pick your house, you, the house is built, you want to walk through, do an inspection. You've got the buyer's agent right there next to you pointing things out like what Johnny said.